This is a three. They're back to back. Good evening from the Kingdom of Balance. This is Princess of Balance here with day 90 of streaming from the Bundle for Racial Justice and Equality of Itch.io. Yeah, so uh, today we are looking at game number 268, uh, which is called Fish Fly Fever. Um, and it's by uh, the Fr uh, Froch Club. And game number 269 hatch by rubeki and game number 270 hellstar squadron by cosmic crystals um, i do this stream every monday and friday so i go through three games a session uh just showcase three games a session um started in july 2020 i expect three more years before i'm done <laughs> uh, but it's been fun so far. I'm going to keep going. So our first game today is uh, Fish Fly Fever by uh, Froach Club. If you want to check it out, here's the link. Uh, let me just paste the link to their... Uh, is that the right one? Yeah, it's this one. Fish Fly Fever by Froach Club. It's at froachclub.itch.io. Right there. Okay. Uh, let me just start loading it up and we can read about it before checking it out. Uh, Fish Fly Fever. Let me see. I need to activate the. we go see it now it's uh, five dollar us at the moment uh, it's called uh, fish fly fever um, it says the fish fly is back in a brand new chaotic cute em up oh it's not shoot em up it's cute em up so it's it's a variety of shoot em up uh, fish flies are microscopic creatures that exist in the depths of planet Overling. They've been sent on an important mission to take out the deadly trio that has been terrorizing their home turf. Okay. Uh, spin left or right to attack planktons with their constant stream of bubbles you leave behind. 
popping planktons creates a gem for you to collect. If you collect them quickly enough, you'll enter fever mode, granting you immense power. Once you have enough gems, a dangerous boss may appear. Defeating the boss allows you to choose an upgrade. Extra gems, bigger shots, or a handy shield. Nice. And 9 unlockable characters, each with their own unique abilities and mechanics. Game Center leaderboards on iOS. Easy viewing. Oh, okay, so this is on iOS as well if you want. Uh, if you are an Apple user. Easy viewing mode, disable backgrounds and explosions. Paint mode turns the game into a drawing toy. Huh. That must be the paint mode we see on the right here. Um, Alright, you can listen to the soundtrack and stuff. Okay, I'm going to check it out. I'm going to play on my um, PC, obviously. But I heard there is a way to stream from iOS, and at some point I'm going to check that out as well. It's, um, it's a phone screen size. Hmm. Cool. Let's see, what do we have? Um, I think the options are okay. I'm going to switch the music off. There we go. So you just hear the game now. And me. So then uh, we have background on and explosions on. Okay, cool. Help. Hit planktons with their bubbles to create gems. E. Cool. <coughs> Collect gems. Gems that look like this are worth two times. Cool. And quickly collect gems for fewer mode, avoid planktons, just enter to pause, bosses appear when you have enough gems, play to unlock new fish flies. Each fish fly has different abilities and music. Cool. Let's try it out. Um, do we use keyboard for this? I think so, let me see. Do we have a... nope, there's no instructions there. Choose your player. Uh, F. Fagio Pisces. Common name Punch. Hobby Baseball. Description Nothing Special. Interesting. What is this thing? Oh, it's the paint mode. Cool. I like how like they bounce a bit when you click on them. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> What's that? What's, what's this thing? Huh. Oh, can I? Oh, I can use a mouse clicker. Okay, right, let's. Nice. I can use the left and right right mouse button. God, <laughs> I am terrible at this. Okay, why is this music still playing? I paused it. Okay, there we go. See what they mean by fever mode now. Nice, I finally did it. Oh, that was a close one. Oh, nice. Oh, this is the fever mode that they talked about. Okay, 
So how much would you get? We got 35 out of 50. That's not bad. Hi, Shelly. How are you doing? We're playing Fish Fly Fever. This game is also on iOS. I, I suck a lot. I died like the first three times. I like I died on the first enemy. really quickly you uh, you enter fever mode which is which looks like that <laughs> yeah because you are a plankton that's what you do. oh I unlocked the boss and I died but I reached 54 which means well 54 unlocked the boss but I also unlocked a new fish fly let's check it out so this one, it's a blue one. Their common name is Dumpy. Their hobby is to grill corn dogs. And uh, shield, big fever, loops the screen. Let's try out the new one. Oh my god. Kinda fat. Oh, loops the screen, that's cool. It had a shield, so it got protected from the first attack. Died. Okay, let's try it again. And let me see. Can I pause? Can I pause? Can I pause? I don't know how to pause. Thank you. Thirty-two more to get unlock a new fish fly. Okay, let's try again. Fever mode. It's big. Expands like that. With big bubbles. Nice. So we're about to encounter a boss.
pretty cool. This one, yeah, with this, with this, um, with this one, uh, you have a special ability and you can like go through the one edge of the screen and wrap around on the other side. But the first one that you start with doesn't have that ability. Thank you. 
pressing the wrong direction. Doesn't seem to be any group bonus here. If you get a whole group, you don't get anything special. Or maybe the double ones show up if you get a whole group. Can't really tell. The game is free on iOS. This would be a fun game to play on your mobile. On your cell phone. On your smartphone. far my highest score has been 57. Excuse me.
11 more. We just needed 11 more to unlock the new fish. Cool. I have mod view open on my laptop because I'm cooking dinner and using my phone for other things, so I'll be checking periodically. Thank you, Haley. I'm having hot chocolate. We took Lulu's prescription to the pharmacy and it's gonna take a week to get to compound. Oh wow, that's a long time. It's very long for just medication. Right? How complex is that medicine? gems disappear so you have to reach for the gems when they show up feels a little like the um, that a ship game I think it's called risk charge or something it feels a bit like that because you're having to get close to the enemy but not actually touch them and that's unintuitive for me feels a bit similar to that. I haven't been able to look at the chat in a bit because this is taking a lot of my focus.
game's paused a bit, I can take a look. What's been going on? Howdy, Joey. How are you doing? I'll have to compound it, which means uh, turn it from pill to liquid, and it's a slow process, apparently. Also expensive. Wow, that's expensive. Hundred and eight for two bottles. How long does she need it? Or it's temporary until I get a chamber for cat inhalers. Oh, okay. That's like 90 bucks. Okay. Not including the inhaler. Pretty good. Just finish my sub badges. Oh, cool. Sub badges. Nice. How's it going? Going good. I just started. That's the first game. Um, I can send you a pic if you want. I'm gonna play Stardew. Is gonna lurk while I make a call. Sounds good. I'm gonna play this a bit more. It's very challenging. I'm gonna try the keyboard, see how that works. Come on. Not exactly better. doesn't have a doesn't seem to have a key to restart the game after so I have to use the mouse for that get bigger it actually doesn't uh, doesn't protect you from the danger it just why are there umbrellas in the background that's kind of funny
bubbles being bigger definitely helps, but the character being bigger means that they get hit much more easily. I guess that's the trade-off. Oh no. intense and relaxing at the same time. It's one of those games. There have been more of those games lately, I noticed. Uh, games that are both intense and relaxing. At least for me. Sometimes I can't see the enemies because of the explosion. I don't realize that there's uh, 
still around because things are exploding around them. Okay. Boss is here. And I ran into it. I want to see if I unlocked... I think I unlocked new ones. Um, no, yeah, I unlocked a kitty one. Look at that. It's called Cuppy. And its hobby is chasing yarn. <laughs> Super fast, heat-seeking fever. Okay, interesting. So there's like a homing missile aspect to it when you uh, get into fever mode. Cool, good to know. Let's see. For two months supply and I have four more refills after that. Thank you, those are awesome. Okay, back to cooking and lurking. Thanks, I'll be streaming either tomorrow or someday this week to hopefully have people show up, show them off. Too. Okay, awesome. It's cool that you have new sub badges. Yeah, everything looks good on here. Alrighty. I'm gonna try the kitty one now. Yeah, the kitty one is fast. So they make bigger circles. Just both good in some ways, but challenging in other ways. Why are they coming from that corner? That's definitely different. Those are fish bones. I guess it's associated with the cat. Aww. I just got into the fever mode, too. out the enemy. That's pretty cool.
also like that. this game that reminds me of any of the things I'm thinking about. I'm gonna try the paint uh, mode. The paint mode is interesting.
it's harder to control because it's faster too. Because that's an interesting way they balance games, is that if they give you a special ability, they also make, a, you know, an ability that makes it go, makes you progress faster, is also more difficult to control. way more unexpected like it would show up at a speed that you're not uh, predicting so from that perspective this one is a lot easier uh, oh almost I was almost at 50 Almost done unlocking the last, uh, the next one, the fourth one. Wow, that was risky. Explosions, I couldn't see where I was. I don't think this game would be very um, easy for people with dyslexia. Taekwondo. Description stops while turning. Stops while turning. Oh. Hey, that's gonna be interesting. Let's see how that plays. Um. Oh, wow. This is very different. I, I 
this spews out numbers. stuck on the wall, otherwise I would have gotten out.
much slower with this one. of the fever. Forgot what it does. run into that exactly. The boss seems to be hard regardless of which one I pick. Also, I think it's balanced by the fact that the enemy the nature of the enemy changes based on which uh, which one you picked. So I guess that makes the difficulty, that kind of adjusts the difficulty. Thank you. 
it's so close. sound was so high. Okay, this is good. I didn't see that the enemies didn't fully get destroyed. Got to try the other mode.
really ah oh, that's not what i want how do i escape out of this oh there we go uh, i want to try the paint mode where is that Ah, there it is. <laughs> that is just so intense. and relaxing at the same time somehow and the paint mode is super weird I guess if you're really high this would be really fun all the colors Oh, there's no bosses in it. Oh, it's, it's just an exploration thing. In, in the in the paint mode, you're just exploring and painting the, which is kind of relaxing. I was wondering why I haven't died yet. So that was pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna switch to the- oh wow, I played for an hour. Um, I'm gonna switch to the next game in a bit. Okay, how do I quit? It's under options. No? Escape? Ah, there we go. So that was uh, Fish Fly Fever. It's $5 on Itch.io. It's free on iOS. Um, I'm not sure sure about other platforms, but these are the only two I know of. Um, and it's been it's it's really relaxing and intense at the same time. Um, yeah, interesting dynamic, interesting mechanics. Um, yeah, so if you want to check it out, 
here's the link again um there you go paste so it's a fish fly fever by froch club it's at frochclub.h.io i'm gonna take a five minute break and i'll be back with our second game our second game is called hatch it's uh it's about a tower it's about climbing a tower it's a first person perspective game yeah so i'll be back with that in a bit and see you in five minutes
Okay, I'm back. Yeah, song. I can't actually hear it because I have it have my audio switched off here. But I'm glad you like it. It's called uh, Abstinent by Abstraction. And the link is just, you know, just above your message shell, Smiley. The link to that song is there if you want to check it out. Um, a new one is starting right now. Okay, so uh, we are going to take a look at Hatch now. So that's um, Hatch by Rubiki. You can get it at rubiki.itch.io. So it's a first person um, ambient climbing. Uh, estimated playtime 30 to 60 minutes or more. And that's the controls, uh, climb by jumping on angled walls. Okay, so I think it's kind of like a, um, the impression I'm getting so far. It's like something like journey. So you're like going to a destination and and you're just, just going there. <laughs> um, yeah, let's check it out. I don't think there's any controller support in this. So I'm just gonna use my keyboard and mouse. Yeah, it looks pretty, right? Hmm, it's taking a long time to load. music in the meantime how's everyone's evening going so far if it is evening in your location it is evening here today is somewhat quiet even though some of my windows are open I'm not hearing a lot of noise outside usually um the noise bothers me during streaming. So far, so good. I love starting my day with you guys. <laughs> I'm glad you. I'm glad that helps. I guess it would be nice to have a regular stream every time you wake up. You just watch that at first. Oh, maybe it's loaded already, huh? I think it is loaded. There we go. <laughs> it was just, I uh, needed to be highlighted. Okay. Let's check this out. Mm. Let's need more sound. The sound is fairly low. Center. Oh, you're hatching from an egg. That's why it's called hatch. He. Don't stay too long in the half sun's gaze. That's, <laughs> oh my god. That is weird looking. It's a really neat idea. Okay. Oh. Barely started. So we can't really, we have to like run. Huh. 
Okay. So if you can see the sun, you have to get away from it. Okay. So it's not like Journey. It's, it's, uh, there's a bit more to it. Looks like an eye too, right? Hmm. It sounds like radiation. Okay. Sun seems to be gone on this side. Where is it? Okay. Well, this is gone. What are these blue thingies? Whoa, is that a whale in the sky? Yeah, I mean, it, it's showing sunset, so I, I figured you'd like it a lot. Why are there people hanging? the angled walled climb that they were talking about these ones cool that's how you climb yeah I guess I could use this too to the top of that tower? Is that what we're doing? You can climb here, I think. No? The sun might be right there. basically blocking it. Huh. Okay, well I got to up to here. I need to get up there. I think, oh, no, 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 no. Okay. here? Maybe? Hmm. 
Whoa. Yeah, how do I get up from here? Oh, no, 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 no. Nah. Uh. Okay. No, no. Uh. could get up there I could kind of go around the corner I think can I drop in here yeah. won't make a difference okay can't really run over there in this, oh, there's that little area. Maybe I can get there. Yeah. Oh, too far. Um, is this wall slanted? Kinda. a spot here.
Okay. Maybe you need to find another path. Is there another path there? Nope. No, there's no path on that side. Keep falling into this thing. I could maybe jump over it. Ooh, okay. Barely made it. Okay. Oh no. Okay. Did I just come from there? It's hard to tell. Where is the sun? Oh. Why is it climbing so slowly? Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Interesting. Oh my god, using that little bar over there. Oh my god. That is so neat. Apparently you can walk around like that, on slanted walls. That's how you do it. I s felt like I was missing something. Cool. But it has to be slanted. Yeah, it has to be slanted just off 90 degrees. For you to climb. Okay. here again through here is there space there's some space hmm. oh barely Again, here.
Doesn't it look like you can climb down. Okay. Not this way. That way, maybe? Jasmine T, thank you for the raid. We're playing a game called Hatch. And you're supposed to climb to the top of the tower while avoiding the sun. your stream it's going okay it's going good um, let me just how was the how's the game you've been playing nowadays here's a shout out for Jasmine T she has really she plays really fun games generally story based which is what I like are we a vampire? <laughs> no, I don't think so. Um, see, the sun is cut. No, we hatched from an egg. Yeah, we we we, we hatched from an egg. That's why it's called the game is called Hatch. And <laughs> um. And it's um, and the sun is not even really uh, no, a normal sun, so um, I'm guessing it's not the same dynamic. 
The sun looks like an eye over there, right? So it's like a half ex eclipse sun. Which looks like an eye. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what we are. Uh, I just know we're supposed to climb. Rifna says, we're not a German Shepherd. <laughs> but we don't know what we are. Uh, oh, that didn't work. We can climb on slanted walls. That that's That's one thing we can do. Well, we looked like a human when we hatched, so... Yeah. That's a long jump. Yeah. We can jump. Okay, I think we're closer to the tower. No, 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 no. Where is it? Oh. Maybe we can climb from this side. It's a weird game, it creeps me out and it's a bit unsettling, but I want to know what is happening, so I keep playing. Oh, the cube game, right? Feels like an insect, maybe? The hatcher. Yeah, it's a humanoid insect. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, that's not the right place. Can I... Way too vertical. We need. <laughs> that would be the direct path, but it doesn't work. Where am I? Yeah, back to the same checkpoint. Since there's no map, I can't tell where we are exactly. But I think we came back to the same spot again. must be a way on this side. I just haven't figured it out yet. Nope. Just came back to the same checkpoint again. There's also whales in the sky. <laughs> There's flying whales. again. Mm. Keeps putting it back here, so I'm guessing this is this is definitely a checkpoint. Can I 
use this one to climb. No? It's too vertical. What about that one? That one looks promising. We still have to get there. Almost. There was a spot right there with the with that line where I could have gone to. reached it. Does it feel weird to have uh, everything so close to your face? I don't know. I, I think this is a regular human sized person. So, I'm just like ramming against the wall constantly because I'm trying to climb them. Okay. Yeah, I can I can do that. All right, there we go. What's the advantage of climbing that? I don't see any. No, no, don't fall. <sighs> okay. Can I climb this one? Yes. No. Uh, nope. None of those are climbable. Nope. Really back here again. Okay. I'm gonna go this way and then maybe run it. Well, maybe I can climb these. Maybe I claim came from there. Okay, I can use those to avoid that. Can I now run across? 
maybe I can run across here. Not too far. Okay. Can go around here. Oh, it's a shortcut here. Cool. Nice. I'm that maybe but how do I reach it can I go there yes I go up here uh, I don't think I can go around um, further up further up Okay, this is, I've been here before, and I can't go further up because it's not slanted in the right way. Is there a wall I can climb here? Nope, nope, nope. If I could just reach that, I could have climbed it. I wonder if there's a wall I can climb down along and go around an obstacle. That might be a thing. Uh, I'm just way down now. But whale's not helping. Just flying way far away. Wrong decision. Okay. Got nowhere from here. You're falling. That's not working. Yeah, so that game was called Hatch. It's by Rubeki. And it has some very weird imagery, but um, very um, interesting exploration. You have to be good at uh, figuring out where the slants are. And possibly go around the bo blocks that are not slanted using the slanted edges. So if you want to check out this game, it's at, um, let me see. There we go. Hatch by Rubiki at, at rubiki.h.io. We got Hydrate. That's done. And we're going to take another five minute break and I'll come back with the last game. Our last game today is called, um, Hi uh, what was it called? A Hellstar Squadron. Yeah. Okay. I'll be back.
be afraid to borrow. Chord progressions, sounds, little ditties, tiny things. Just snatch them all up. Respectful, like we leave them like a little note saying thank you very much for what you've done. Okay, I am back. I uh, got a couple of questions here. Uh, okay, what channel do I play uh, from Pretzel Rocks? Um, I play the um, Chill Station. So uh, I think it's just called Chill because there's several versions of Chill. There's Chill Bass and there's uh, Chill Rocks or something. I play just the one that's called Chill. And that's that's the one I like the best, actually, among all the ones I tried. Uh, this has been the most relaxing one, so that's the one I play. 
yeah what i do with my music as well nowadays is um i created a obs doc for for pretzel rocks as like a browser doc um and that has enabled me to just control um, the music right from my streams yeah yeah relaxing is nice right okay uh, the next game is hard to launch from the launcher so I need I installed it separately where is it oh I'm in the wrong L star squadron there we go Okay, so we're looking at Hellstar Squadron now. Hellstar Squadron is by uh, Cosmic Crystals. You can get to their profile at uh, cosmiccrystal.h.io. Here's the link in the chat. Um, Hellstar Squadron. So it says uh, the year is 2070X 20, AD. The galactic government entity known as Paradise is set um, is at threat from terrifying demonic rebellion. Join the Hellstar Squadron on this epic adventure as you dodge wave after wave of bullets, shoot the demons back to hell, and save the galaxy from this fresh, in this fresh retro-inspired arcade shoot 'em up bullet hell experience. Uh, three playable characters. Uh, ships to commandeer, uh, multiple difficulties including normal, hard, and veteran, eight cosmic stages to blast your way through, big bosses with uh, heaps of bullets and explosions, an unlockable boss rush game mode, retro arcade experience including CRT shader and Tate mode options, uh, jamming chiptune soundtrack, uh, the galaxy needs you, the Hellstar Squadron awaits. Okay, it's uh, $1.99 at the moment, it's pretty cool. Um, I installed this separately on my desktop, so let's do that. There we go. I don't know why this is on. <sighs> Kingdom Hearts. I need to finish Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. It's still on. I'm on mission 750. Right now, still 250 to go, or 200 to go, I think at least uh, it's also inspired by your eternal darkness summaries to add a notepad to my stream for my puzzle solving for rusty lake that is a great idea yeah i totally support that idea because then you can um i mean okay in the past when games were really complex i used to have to oh it started chiptune music uh, it's the wrong window. There we go. Can I use my controller for this one? Where is my controller? Yeah, in the past when games were really difficult, I had to use actual physical paper to write notes. Uh, sound is pretty loud. Okay, I'm going to turn it down a bit. There we go. There we go. Yeah, so it's a great idea to use a notepad. I think it's going to help. Especially for, for puzzle solving. Um, finally, sitting down to eat. Uploaded pics of dinner. Oh, cool. Awesome. I stopped playing. Oh. Stop playing? Uh, what did you stop playing? Oh, okay. Making me hungry all over again. I hope you're well. Stop playing Kingdom Hearts Union Cross a while ago. Okay, I just got the updates to the story, but I need need to catch up. Okay, yeah. Good things. Just excited to finally eat. Been emotional all day, but a good day. Um, how are you, Jasmine T? I think the game music... Yeah, it's a little loud. I turned it down. 
Uh, yeah, I was using pen and paper in the first two games, so that helped a lot. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm planning to... Right now, I'm using the notes from Eternal Darkness as a practice for when I do, like, Kingdom Hearts conspiracy boards. Um, because that's going to be much more involved. So, so right now, I'm just practicing with other games because Eternal Darkness is, is very way simple compared to Kingdom Hearts. Oh, right. There's a hydrate. Sorry, I forgot about that. Thank you. Um, yeah, with Kingdom Hearts, I have to keep track of who's who's nobody, who's who's heartless. What? How do how do each person split? And then there's the uh, I think there's four dimension, three dimensions, and no, four dimensions. Yeah, four different worlds all together, and and multiple not multiple timelines at least time travel doesn't change the past in 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 uh kingdom hearts so that's a good thing but we have to follow multiple characters so there's going to be multiple um paths um so yeah that's going to be complex so i'm right now practicing making notes on a graphics program so that uh, we can have a smoother experience when uh, when we do that. <laughs> uh, pen and paper. Graduation is thirst. Oh yeah, awesome! I'm glad it's coming up so soon. It's gonna be nice, right? Can't wait to go in that cage <laughs> rabbit hole with you. Yeah, yeah, I'm. Right now, like, the only thing that's... Okay, there's a few things blocking me. One is the lack of practice. One is the lack of assets that I can use in my Kingdom Hearts um, boards. Another one is, like, I have to find a way to make... I have to find a way to play um, the uh, DS games. So, I'm still working on that part. Um, if I can get the DS games running... And I can play all the games except for obviously Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, which is ending on June 29th is when they're closing the servers. Um, but I did find a way, uh, I think I found a way to stream from my cell phone. So at the very least, we can look at the cutscenes together at some point. Whatever is in this salad is strong tasting and delicious. Yeah, the DS games would be would be the next part that I need to work on. Uh, character select. Okay, new game. Uh, Azure, Citrine, Emerald. Okay. Okay, so Azure is uh, wave guns, turrets, and hyper beam. Uh, Citrine is laser, cannon, missiles, and ultra beam. Okay. And this one is burst fire, sentries, and power beam. Well, three attack types. I'm gonna start with Azure and see what happens. Game type, adventure. Yeah, that's the only option. Uh, difficulty, normal. Well, that's the only option, apparently. The year is 2070x80. I think it's the same story that's, um. Yeah. For decades, celestial bodies under the control of paradise have been at peace. This great era has ascended their society with numerous technological and cultural advancements. It's said that the stability of the paradise's rule is secured due to the empire's possession of ancient religious artifacts that hold great power. These remain hidden from its civic population. Many have dismissed these tales as mere folklore or myth, but a new rebellion has arisen. Naming themselves for greater demons, whose names were supposed to have been forgotten, this order of pale-skinned, red-eyed rogues has amassed forces that it plans to use in frontal attack on the Paradise Empire. In an effort to defend itself against this new enemy, the central government has assembled an elite force of space fighters. Each possess proven combat experience and significant tactical skills and firepower. The fighting force is only known as the Hellstar Squadron.
Yeah, there is a way for me to stream directly from the phone. Yes. Uh, you told me about it recently, so I, that's what I'm thinking of doing. Uh, I was listening to K soundtrack and getting nostalgic for K1. I was watching someone play uh, Melody of Memory, um, Melody of Memory, and there was a, um, there were music in it from the DS games. You've played it, so you know already. But um, yeah, there were music from the DS games, and I was like, oh my god, that makes reminds me of how fun it was to play those. I kind of want to stream Kingdom Hearts, but the only way I would do that is if Lily is with me. <laughs> oh my god, really? You want that experience of me controlling every aspect of where, where you should look and what you should fight? And <laughs> Yeah, well, Shelly does that with me with Stardew, so it's kind of the same. Yeah. Yeah, Meld of Mary looks fun. I'm gonna suck at it, but it does look fun. The rhythms are well placed. Uh, you do better that way with those kind of games? Okay, well, if you say so. I'm sure we'll find a way to help you. So they send their weakest to fight us. You and your squadron don't ch stand a chance. The good people of this galaxy stand against you, demon. We will fight. Okay. The gates are opening as we speak. You can't stop us. Okay. Oh wow, this looks awesome. Did I get hit without realizing? I got hit without realizing. I got hit without realizing, okay. Okay, I don't know what are the other controls because right now I'm just using one button and I'm dead. <laughs> so this, uh, the, 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 can I skip this? Can I skip this? No. What are the other powers? Did I just get hit again? I'm guessing red is bad, but gray is good. Are the grays the pickups? Are those pickups? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Got a shield. Shield now. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, 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 I missed that pickup. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. That was a bomb thingy that I threw. That's with the X. Uh, okay. Boss battle. You broke through my forces. I told you we would stop fighting. Tell me where the next uh, fortification is and sir, I'm missing the pickup. I won't give that. This is, let's go. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, crap. Oh, I lost the shield. I lost the shield. I lost the shield. Oh, crap. On my last health now. Pick up, pick up, pick up. I don't know what it gave me. I can't even look right now. Um. Oh. Yeah. That was a bomb I used. Uh, no, 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 no. Ah. Okay, fine. This feels wrong somehow. I don't know why, like, the setting seems a little wrong. There's something wrong. 
just because something is called paradise doesn't mean it's actually like a paradise. There's something off about it. There's a pickup there. There's a pickup there. I, I don't know what I got. But I got it. I got a shield now. Got another pickup. I don't know what it is. I was hoping it would be a heart, but there doesn't seem to be any heart so far. Another one. Oh, I got uh, an extra bomb. Oh no! Get out! Get out! Okay. Oh yeah, I got extra firepower there. Nice. Oh, I got a heart finally. Can I get the boss now so I can? No. I'm well equipped for the bus. Oh no, I'm missing that pickup. Oh, I got it. I got another heart. Awesome. Thirteen. Oh my god. Pick up, pick up. Ugh. Whatever that pickup was, I risked my shield to get it. And I lost my shield. Okay, you know what? Do the missile. Do the missile, do the... Got the pickup, whatever it was. Yeah! Oh. Oh, I got it! I got it, I got it. <sighs> okay. Oh, pretty. Look at that. The fighter that took out our youngest kin. You don't look like much. Maybe not, but I know I have it. Have what it takes to take you and your rebellion down. Your ship is weak as are you, human. Prepare to fight my loyal legion. Okay. Ooh, we got so much bullets now. I'm having a hard time seeing my own bullets because of the background. The colors are too close. The enemy ones are still mostly visible. Nice, I got another shield. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, there is <laughs> definitely a lot on the screen. I'm down on my last life here. Why are you exploding with so many bullets? The ship is hard to see. I don't, I don't I have a hard time seeing where I am. There's like blue water and and I missed that. Okay. Okay, it continues from where I left off. That's good. At least. Oh, the instructions are right there. 
I didn't use the beam yet. Oh, I don't have a beam. Yeah, I got a shield. It's gonna be useful. Cool. got up to here so far I <laughs> at least I guess the power-ups are useful yeah there's another one okay good thing I can just hold the power button the fire button colors are really strong in this level For, uh, I'm doing really well for this type of game because I usually die like so many times and yeah I'm surprisingly doing well come on okay I did but I had to have to stop you at all costs all right, then let's see what we have. Okay. Oh, do I have to hold that button? No. My god. Oh my god, really? Okay. Oh, oh shoot. Okay, that's way too confusing. Can't believe I survived that so far. Uh, I didn't. Oh my god, I didn't. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Now, demon, we have what we need. Uh, yeah, there's something wrong with this story. Something is wrong with the story. Oh, damn. Okay, at least the colors are better in this one. You are leaving quite the path of destruction in your wake. Why do you fight, human? A fight for the future of humanity, for paradise. You need not fight long then. This galaxy will belong to us soon enough. Why do you need that much space? Why does anyone need that much space? <laughs> You get a couch that big that you need an entire galaxy to fit it into? I got destroyed. And I got a shield after. Right. Let's use the beam weapon. Let me just obliterate using beams. Um, beams are good for certain enemies. This is reminding me of Xenon now. For those who don't know, Xenon is an old DOS uh, game like this. Um, it was very weird looking. 
uh, it was in space, obviously, but uh, the uh, the f creatures you're fighting look like sea creatures. Like, you know, from deep sea. They look like bugs and sea creatures. Crustaceans. Ah! Okay. I got out of that. The beams make you slow as well. That's the uh, downside to using the beams. Oh, come on. Wow, I'm on the third boss? Uh, join our cause. I would never side with the likes of you. Okay, and you... Okay. stop here. I think that demonstrates what the game is like in general. Okay. My eyes are a little buzzed right now. <laughs> uh, that was a lot of um, eyesight concentration there. Um, are we... Is the music playing? Why is the music... Oh, okay, it is playing. Cool. Okay, so that was uh, Hell Squad Hellstar Squadron, and it's about two dollars right now um, on Ichio. So here's the link again for those who want to check it out. It's by Cosmic Crystal, so it's Cosmic Crystal dot uh, Cosmic Crystal dot H dot I O. Yeah, fun for someone whose eyes can handle it, yeah. It also has a CRT filter, as you can see on the right, on this pink image here. It has scan lines, so those of you who like it, like, retro-looking, it's, uh, that option is there. I personally really liked the, um, the animation. I thought it was very smooth, um, for a, um, for a game like that. And the bullet speed was very easy to handle for me compared to my usual experience with them. I only died, what, four times and I got to level three. So that's, that's not bad. I think that was a good balance there. Okay. Uh, right. So that concludes our, uh, which session was this? Uh, this is the 90th, right? Yeah, this was day 90 of uh, streaming uh, indie games from the Bundle for Racial Justice and Equality of Ichio. I've been doing this since July 2020. I need another three years to finish the whole bundle. I'm at game number, we just finished game number 270 with Hellstar Squadron, which is pretty good. 270 games so far. Not bad, I think. <laughs> Uh, almost coming up to a year. Yeah, in a couple of months, it'll be a year and a month and a half. So I'll probably have about like game number 300 soon on the 100th session. Uh, yeah, so that'll be pretty cool. Um, I'm still working on my Discord server and working on some sub badges. So maybe I'll unveil it for the uh, 300th game, which would be my 100th session. <laughs> Yeah, I'm excited to see how uh, to be able to reach that. I'll be, I'll be pretty fun to be able to say that I reached that. Yeah. Oh, and uh, thank you for doing the shout out there. I was just about to talk about Rifna. Um, yeah, so today we looked at game number 268. Um, Fish Fly Fever by Froach Club. Then uh, game number 269, Hatch by Rubeki. And game number 270, Hellstar Squadron by Cosmic Crystals. Uh, here are the links to the game in the chat. 
all three of them and um, the art on this stream is done by Rifna you can see their art credits on the bottom right corner I'll also paste them in chat um, we have Rifna's Pinterest uh, Redbubble and Twitter and uh, we just did a shout out to Rifna as well uh, they stream on Tuesdays um, as well I, um, they stream point and click games generally we I join them on their streams on Tuesdays at um, around 8 p.m. Um, we have been going through the Monkey Island series and uh, we're in Monkey Island 2 at the moment mm, yeah yeah it's a lot of fun um, my next stream is on Wednesday for Eternal Darkness because Wednesdays is when I show off games that I loved in the past um, I'm working through Eternal Darkness and analyzing it. We are in chapter, we just finished chapter 10, I think. 9 or 10. Yeah, I think it's chapter 9 that we just finished. Okay, so we're going to continue with that. And on Friday is my next indie stream. Okay, so let's see who we can raid. Um, Shelly said Fire Don't Talk is playing. Uh, oh, Star Renegades, that sounds fun. Uh, let's go check that out. Let's raid Fire Don't Talk and watch some um, Star Renegade. I think it's a pretty uh, uh, fun strategy game. Okay, so let's go check that out. And thank you all for uh, joining. And um, it was really fun. And uh, thank you, Jasmine T. Um, you can lurk for the raid. Awesome. Also, a shout out to uh, Shell Smiley, um, who's my frequent mod. <laughs> there we go. We play Remnant together sometimes, so that's also fun. All right, so we are ready to raid. Um, and um, yeah, let's go watch that. And I'll see you all next time, hopefully on Wednesday. Bye.